All right, I want to introduce you to another plant. This is a velvet leaf. It's got very large heart-shaped leaves, very pronounced veining underneath. The leaves are very soft, and when you touch them, it'll feel like velvet. It's got small orange flowers. These aren't completely opened, but uh, you can see there they are. It'll grow very tall and grows in bushes, uh, five or six foot tall, pretty commonly. Uh, it's uh, an introduced plant and uh, is very invasive. And in a lot of areas, it's actually illegal to uh, plant to grow it for yourself. Uh, it, it's very invasive and a lot of uh, your herbicides won't affect it, so farmers aren't real fond of this plant. Although it was imported to make uh, textiles and fabrics and rugs, the fibers in the stalk, the stalk is very soft, feels like uh, velvet and felt. Uh, it's round and smooth, no, uh, no odd colors or discolorations. It's all, all green, very soft. And, uh, when you touch it, it'll feel like you're touching uh, a velvet stem, easy to separate into uh, individual strands and fibers to twist into uh, cordage that's very strong and can be woven into a fabric. The seed pods here look like a little button and they're full of little black seeds and it's very nice when they uh, when they're fully ripened They'll start to turn brown, the leaves will curl up, start to fall off, and then you can collect the seeds that are inside this very easily, just throwing it in a, a blender or a food processor, and then uh, winnowing out the chaff and saving just the seeds. And then the seeds can be ground into flour and it's a really nice, kind of a nutty flavor, a nutty aroma to it also. But as you can see, it grows in large bushes. It likes distressed soil and uh, the edge of fields. It will get into the fields and that's why the farmers dislike it so much. Uh, hopefully when the, when the plants are ripe to harvest. I can collect some of the seeds and I'll do a video showing how to turn the, the seeds into a flower and then make uh, some bread with it. It's an unleavened bread, but it makes a good flat bread with a very nice nutty flavor. Again, this is a velvet leaf. Very useful, very handy, very common. If this has uh, helped you with anything, please like, and subscribe, and share it with your friends. Thank you very much.